Alright, hello everybody, welcome back to Ocarina of Time. I made my way back to the Forest Temple, and here I am, talking to Sheik. Hold on, I'm changing my volume. Okay, so here I am talking to Sheik. I'm not going to read this because we already went through this. We're about to, to learn the minute of the forest or whatever. This is the first session of the day, so... Yeah, minute of forest. Minute. Boom, bam, bam. I've been waiting for a girl like you. That's what that song reminds me of. I've been waiting for a Zelda like you. Fucker, I'll see you again. Yeah, we have the whole name change going on here. Now, I was thinking about I was thinking earlier about if I'll be doing Majora's Mask or not. I probably said in this Let's Play that I'm not. But I'm really deciding whether I want to or not. Because, I mean, that's another blind Let's Play I could do. And... If it goes the same as well as this one, then I see why not. So, um, whoa. Whoa, <laughs> that was crazy. Alright, so we're going to be fighting these dogs. Nice. That was for me, anyway. <laughs> nice for... for what I did. Um, I'm gonna hook shot myself up here. Uh, if I aim it right, I guess I could. No, I'll just climb up. No big deal. Uh, I did practice this beforehand. I practiced about a couple days ago. And... I don't have it down completely, but I have a general idea. I didn't practice the boss fight. I just practice, you know, my way around here, the basics. So I'll, I'll make my way there. Hopefully, this episode. Oh my god! Not if I do that though. How stupid! Sorry. <laughs> I'm playing on a different resolution right now. Like I'm not playing widescreen. I'm playing you know, normal screen, I guess you'd call it. Uh, looks looks a lot sharper. I don't really like widescreen if it stretches the pixels like that. Alright, let's get to the end of this. As far as we can. Boom. Open it up. Key. We did get this far before. I'm just trying to catch up. I gotta remember to hold up when I do that. Alright. I don't know if I showed this off last time, but hook shots take it out in one one swipe. Alright, we're gonna do something different this time besides what we did last time. We're not gonna go immediately left. We're gonna go straight. Get some keys. Fight some stupid. I keep forgetting the name of them. I'll have Navi to tell me. I've been having trouble speaking lately. Especially with that update video I uploaded. That was horrible. I could not speak. Right now, I, I, I'm not doing much of a better job, but... We aren't going for Skulch List, by the way, just remember. It's, it's better to, to aim it yourself at those flying skulls, because... If you try to Z-target it, by the time you Z-target it, it's going to be right in your face. This is tough, actually. Um, I'm going to switch to my Hylian sword. No, the Master Sword, I guess you'd call it. I meant the shield, but I meant I have to... Um, it's a good idea to use your Master Sword in here because you need your shield. As, as soon as I swipe, you need to swipe. 
just this might take a little bit longer than you hope, but I don't know why my sword is not out by the time I'm Sometimes you get behind him. It's good. Sometimes they do hit you through your shield. In the neck, in one of the rooms, we have to fight two of them, and we have to make sure they're dead at the same time, which is a really difficult thing to do. Um, so, get used to those things. Okay, alright. So I think there's a fairy in here, and I'm going to try to grab it. I probably can't, because I don't have full health. But, I'm going to try. Oh, thank god. Now I have full health. There we go. That's gonna come in, in handy later. I'm glad I caught a fairy. Oh, I'm gonna use my bombs right here. Alright, moving on. This is why I use the fucking bigger on sword, because. It's just demolishes them. I might use my bigger on sword for the next um the next I can't remember those goddamn names. Okay. Um I guess we'll go in this room now. So remember to use the song of time. I remember. That's Sun Song. What am I doing? Why did I do Sun Song? Isn't it like. Wow, I got it. Nice. Alright. I'm starting to like this game, for anyone that's wondering. Fucking avoid this guy. Okay. So I got these guys. Let's get up there. Um, even with the Zora tunic, we can't get the chest under the water yet because we can't open chests underwater. Just a little piece of advice. Um, so we're gonna do it the long way, the only way really, and that means getting hit by a Sculptula. Really no way of avoiding this guy. Guess you gotta be like right on it. No, cause you can't see it. I got past this guy last time by... I guess dumb luck, but I mean... I guess it's just gonna make sure it's not looking at you. Yeah, fuck you, buddy. <laughs> They're just fucking relentless. You can't really hit them. You gotta be lucky when you hit them. That's what I think anyway. They could just easily tear apart your health. Alright, first big chest in this dungeon. This is probably boring because I know what's happening, but... I mean, would you rather me be confused and not know what to do for 20 minutes or actually get some progress done so I could actually progress in the story? You gotta ask yourself that. Ooh, you seem like a menace. Alright, this is a weird... A weird shot. We actually have to get on this railing. Boom. There you go. 
and hit the switch, and that drains the water. So now we can go down there. And we'll hopefully land in the water right here. Do a back foot. Nice. I give that a ton of a ten out of ten. Alright. Alright. Let's not do that. Let's hopefully not get hit by the Octorok either. Octorok. Why am I on even on this side? I need to be on that side. Hey, can you not back up on anything anymore? Nice. Alright. Got some recovery hearts, thank god. Just enough. I probably went right past the chest. No, no, I didn't. Right here, right? Yes. Very small. Okay, so now that we have three, we can go back into the main room, start unlocking some doors. You need to have three, and most people miss the one in the first room. So, always remember to, to get that one. It's pretty easy to miss. I didn't miss it because I thought I had to look it up. Okay, here we are. Um... This room up here, it's locked, so we're gonna go in there. I was pretty sure that was in there. And of course, this big bully. Trying to be the bigger man here. Alright. So now, where are we going? Got lucky there. Alright, so now begins the fun. Fun in which there's a maze ahead. Not much of a maze, but it's still a maze. Luckily, <laughs> again, I know what I'm doing. Yes, Navi. Hopefully I can get pretty far in 20 minutes. I only have about seven and a half minutes left. Depend it depends how far I am, and if I'm far, then I might just continue. If not, if I still got a way to go, then I'm just gonna call it quits, come back next time. So now that this block is getting pushed, you gotta follow the arrows, remember? It'll stop right there. So now you gotta go around. Push it on the switch, which is right over here. There you go. So now you just climb up. And then begins another puzzle. Grab this one. How Link grabs a completely a flat block is beyond me, but hey. I'm not judging. Um, see that we can't get any, any further. So now, we gotta backtrack. We go back here, and as you might have saw, there's a ladder. So we go up on the ladder. Go around. There it is. And you push it. So now, that's right there. Don't do that. I didn't mean to do that. Now that it's back in that position, you just gotta go back to um, where you were. Up here. I just messed up and apparently wanted to fall into an abyss. So now that's here. You can push it. And... Boom. And that's it. I've had, I, I've seen people get this confused for some reason. I, I thought it was pretty straightforward even before I saw it. 
Like, even before I saw someone do it. It seemed pretty straightforward. Well, I'm gonna take a drink of my coffee before it gets very cold. Today I'm drinking New England coffee. Seeing that I live in New England, I thought I'd try my own coffee. It's pretty good. I, that's why I'm drinking it. I've actually had more than one cup of this stuff before. It's, it's delicious. If you ever come to New England, our coffee's very good. Um, so now you can see that there's a... a... silver eye, and... You'll probably try to hit it with your hookshock, like, you know, we've been taught to do. That's not the case. That's actually for the new weapon. And this is my favorite room ever. This corridor is all twisted. Yeah, good fucking telling me. Um, next comes a very um, anger-inducing part for many people. There's wall masters. There are wall masters here, and... They will fucking eat you up if you do not hurry the hell up. So I suggest you hurry the hell up, unless you want to get eaten. So now that, you know, you're done that, you can see a Poe right there. Um, you can't hurt it, because as soon as you go near it, it'll go away. So, nothing in here. Let's just continue. So now, here's the part I was talking about. They can walk on top of that thing, as you cannot. I took him out pretty fast. So now you gotta take care of these two guys at once. I suggest just wailing on it with the bigger on sword. The master sword does nothing to them. I don't see any strategy in that. Seeing as though it's it's like maybe five or seven seconds the other one gets back up. So you got to be really fast. Just keep weakening both of them, you know. I did it pretty sporadically, honestly. So. A bow and arrow. I'm gonna set that to my X button. Or my right C button, if you want to be technical. Right. So now. I think this is what we're gonna come out of. Um, since we have the fairy bow now, we can. Now take care of those. Those pose. As you can see, they're right there. Just shoot them with your bow. I'll take care of the picture. So now, the next one's probably up here. Yeah. Aim. Yeah, that's a little tricky. There you go. And you gotta back up because the other painting's right behind you. So he shows up. Right there. And now, we're just gonna take care of him. These are pretty easy. These are these are like the easiest freaking things ever. I would not worry about it. Um, Z target him. I'm. I don't know him, but just try to avoid him. Then when he pops back up. Oh, what am I thinking? What am I thinking? Use your bow. Don't hit him with your sword. I feel kind of stupid now. Gonna take a couple shots, but don't worry. Just keep your distance. This is pretty boring. I mean, Forest Temple is not my favorite temple by all means. Yeah, if you get too close, he'll start attacking. 
There we go. Luckily he dropped arrows. And now that flame is there. I'm pretty sure the flame goes to the main room too. We're at 20 minutes right now. I should compass. Okay, so since we don't have a key, we can't go back up, so let's just go back to where we were, I guess. So we're gonna go back up here, we're gonna defeat this Poe. Stupid thing is, is that if you hold the button, you can't really release it. Uh, you have to like, you have to take a shot, so I always hold it by accident, I don't mean to, I seem to always do that, I should just get used to pressing it, so I don't waste my arrows, that's just a freaking habit of mine, that was a really bad shot, but I got it anyway. <coughs> Just like in Wind Waker, we'll be getting ice arrows and maybe fire arrows. I'm not really sure. Probably, if you get ice arrows, why not fire? Yeah, I'm thinking about Majora's Mask. I I want to play it. Some most of my friends that play Zelda um, say that Majora's Mask is their favorite, and Ray J himself even said Majora's Mask is his favorite. So, I mean, his taste in video games is, I don't want to say exactly like mine, but it's very similar in mine, which is why I, I guess I watch him so much, because he has great taste in games. So, I mean, Majora's Mask might, might happen. Might happen. Depends. Obviously, it doesn't depend if I have it, because it's on the collector's edition for GameCube. I have that, so... Who knows? I'm definitely not playing the Master Quest on this game. I'd probably stream that if I was ever going to play it. So... Don't get your hopes up. If you go back through here, and we look at the... Ah, oh, never mind. I, I was going to do something else. Um, my plans changed. Whatever. Since we have a... These respawn. Cool. I was really... I think they're Stalfos. That's what I was thinking. Stalfos. Yeah, yeah. I keep thinking Scalpos, not Stalfos. Scalpos. So stupid. Alright. So now there's wall masters in this room too, so... Be careful. This is where I got sucked up the most, was this fucking room. These guys are fucking annoying. For me, anyway. They look like the cover of an Avenged Sevenfold freaking CD. Okay, so there's no key. Um. I'm taking my sword. Let's look down here for a second. Yeah, we're gonna go back. Yeah, I know. If you didn't stop me right here, obviously I won't get captured, but since you stopped me, I was get captured. Okay, back up over this. Nice. Save me some time. It reminds me, I haven't seen Cosmo stream in a long time. He keeps streaming at the weirdest times, like when I'm at school. So I never get to see it. But, so I always watch his broadcast after, like maybe a couple hours after. I like how Twitch does that. 
I don't have to be there to watch it. I can just watch it on my own time. Alright, so... Wow, that was weird. I don't know how I did that. Almost like I just did that. Which was bad. I'll fight it. Those things are scary. <laughs> they are, they're kind of scary. They make me think of tarantulas, and I hate tarantulas. Alright, so since we're back here... I'm gonna just kill these things so I don't die. You're not dead? So now that that's over with, let's this, this will untwist them. Pretty cool, right? I think so. Now what am I gonna do? I actually do not know. Oh yeah, there's a chest. Wrong side, smarty. But this is already the the key. Unfortunately, we don't have enough keys to actually get back. I wanna fight you. I wanna fight you. I do this. Fuck this room back up. I'm going at it blind because I don't remember. <coughs> Sorry about that. I want to go back into the windy room or the wall master room, I guess. See if there's any switches out there because there is a twisty room. I guess that's for the better. I'm kind of glad that happened so I could just look back at here. I have to defeat everything again. Which is good too because if it drops hearts, I get hearts. Um, so there should be yeah, two lit torches. Can't go this way, right? Yeah, block it. Uh, went that way. We were going that way. There's nothing in there that leads to a dead end. It was this way I was going, but... What am I to do? Let's just go back. I don't know. Although I kind of mind if I have to do this part again. You can't hook shot to doors, by the way. Just saying. It's kind of a weird thing that you can't hook shot to. I really hope my puzzle is not. Oh, thank God. 
That makes me kind of happy. My screen jet server just turned on. Weird. Okay. There's gotta be something. There's a chest in here, according to my map. Look at my map. I'm in a room with a chest. It's three chests. Well, I'm going to figure this out next time. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. And goodbye.